Hello everybody, welcome back. So today we hopefully are going to finish our temple and see how far we can grow the tribe and just see what happens. And uh, hopefully we get another migration this time. We didn't get one the previous time. And let's see how things go. Let's start. Let's quickly see if uh, I have zero pregnancies at this stage, one baby. Let's see, I must put the guys on food. So take all nine off fishing. And of course we must give them all the other food to collect. Because there won't be any mushrooms now. Temple should be very close now. We're almost at 90%. So we should finish our temple at least this uh, episode. So... Uh, Thank you guys for joining the stream we did on Wednesday. I really enjoyed it. Um, please keep it up. And if you want to, you can leave comments and we can continue discussions in the comments. But I really enjoyed that. So thanks for everybody that was there. Let's see how many people do we have. Okay, we have one pregnancy. That's very good. So we're almost at 40 people. Almost. We had a very bad fishing. Look, we only have seven fish left. So fishing were not uh, that good to us. Let's see our groups. What are we? What do they consist of currently? Okay, it's looking good. Let's just quickly see. Two week, two week. Let's quickly check the children. Oh, we have a child that can work. Let's put that child on food as well. Oh, I think it was one of our crafting people. That's also fine. Still chilling out. Uh, which is fine. What is our builders doing currently? Okay, there's no mushrooms, you guys can chill. Okay, so let's take that one away so that we can get our groups full. How did it go? How did it go? 91%. Excellent. Let's tell our builders where are they? Let's tell them to gather some uh, stone for us. It would be really interesting to see if we get another migration, what they will bring to the party. I think we'll look a little bit more in detail to what... Uh, their stuff are. We also have a lot of logs as well. I'm happy about that. We can maybe start building a few things. So 
so, so close. I always have a big food problem, specifically in spring, I don't know. So I can't wait every time for summer, that's usually when we get enough food to run everything. Let's quickly check something. How many people are on idle currently? 10. Let's quickly check it them out. It's 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, this I believe is one of our crafting. So it's those 10 that are currently not helping but I believe that one is a crafting so our crafting no, the crafting guys are working we'll just check if the next day if everybody is working and that guy is still we can put them back to food what food are I struggling to get okay no, that's fine let's see our leaders policies our leaders policies are decent very decent Just their intelligence, that's not that good. Okay, let's quickly check our groups again. Everybody is working. Is that one still doing nothing? Let's go back to food. Add that one. There you go. No, wait. Why? Okay, I'm not going to worry about that now. Key bringing in wood for us people, or logs. Key bringing in logs. Our stone is also picking up very nicely. How is everything looking? Just the one pregnancy. These two will break down very soon, but we have more. Well, we have more than enough for it to fix them. So close. Let's see if the fish are slowly coming back because I believe we we might have overfished a little bit. It looks like it. I don't see any fish. We might have overfished a little bit. Just a little bit. And now it's dark. Okay, let's check this river. So we might have just a little bit overfished. But hopefully they will be back before autumn time.
Now we'll see. Otherwise, we'll just push clams a little bit. We still have a big, big lake here. But it does seem like everything is running kind of smoothly. And worst case is we will migrate, but I don't want to migrate. We were so close to having our temple done. I hopefully I'm not wasting any food anywhere, it doesn't look like it at least. Wait, I see fish. Fish are returning. Yes. Thank goodness. A lot of fish. There you go. Come back buddies. We have a long winter ahead of us. Okay, so they at least fix the one storehouse. Let's see. Ah, two more pregnancies and that baby was born. So, there you go. This one lady is a little bit upset, but we'll see if she stays upset. Currently, we cannot really afford to give them that two-day break. Our food is not really where I want it. But I don't see any unhappy people over here. And people keep bringing the stone, keep bringing it. But I'm really loving the discussions and stuff you guys are bringing to the channel. Um, really, please keep it up. Hopefully, I do contribute a little bit to it. But uh, thanks for that. And I really love it. The discussions are always good and fun. And hopefully, as the channel grows and as uh, the game itself grows, the discussions will become more and more and hopefully a lot of the ideas and stuff that you guys share or want comes into the game. That would be amazing. Now this game has massive potential. Massive. What are they stacking over here? It looks like by faces, I think. 
That must be. Almost summer, then our rosy pet list will boom. I might try to last a little. Okay, a group of migrants has arrived. Pause, pause. Okay, let's go and check them out. Wow. Wow. This is the most migrants we have gotten in uh, one shot. Six of them. 24. She has a lot of positives. A lot. This, this uh, lady is amazing. Wow, she could be the next leader. Uh, this one is still a child, still growing, no negative traits that I can see. Okay, this one has a few negative traits. Let's quickly check them out. Unhandy, so minus 26 on skill and feeble. So this was a very weak child. So I like it. There's the migrant uh, thing. She brings with her Osor, is, is that part of the migrant group? Let's quickly check. Yes, so it, it almost, okay, let's check, check her out. So no negative traits that I can see. Okay, let's check the next one. Okay, so that was the one with all the negative traits. The first two are good. This one currently is not bad. Let's see the negative trait on this one. Her intelligence is not that good. Does she bring anybody? Okay, she's a lone wolf. Her fitness is good. Okay, let's check the man that's... It's all of them ladies. Okay, that, that's a boy. So two men and uh, four ladies, looks like. Okay, she's, we said it's her intelligence. Ah, oh, come on. And he, what does he bring? He's clumsy, so his skill is not that good. Aloof, a shot to his charisma, but he is smart. And he is determined. So this is actually a very good group. Specifically, I'm very impressed with this lady. Very impressed with her. So of course we are going to accept him. Please welcome to, to our tribe. We are very happy to have you. Here they are. Welcome to our tribe. So this will definitely become more and more important as uh, the game develops, you have to start at some stage, look at your tribes people and decide if people are going to be worth it or not. But I, I'm very happy, that lady is amazing. And now we have a few extra hands that we can use. I'm definitely going to put at least two of them Two more of them on food. Now that was an excellent migration group. Now the food should pour in and I think we should have at least one or two that's that we can now use as well. Let's add two more at the raw side. Okay, everybody should be working now. Let's see the groups. Okay, I'm happy. I'm very happy. Now that, that was amazing. So you do get bigger ones. I was wondering if you get uh, migrant groups that were bigger than the 444 we got the whole time. 99% almost done. 
And that was an excellent group. And uh, hopefully in the new update, if a group like this comes, they bring a lot of knowledge with them that they share with the tribe. I'm very excited to see what uh, how they're going to do that update. Okay, let's go and change the food are dropping rapidly. Let's tell them we only want them to collect rose heap. We will just see if we have enough sleeping space or if we should build another but we'll see now when it's night. We do have an unhappy camper there, but uh, we cannot afford to give them time off currently. Okay, so let's... Okay, there's still one outside. Find yourself a sleeping place, buddy. Come on. Everybody in the huts. There you go. No more movement. So let's see how much space we have. Two, two... Okay, now it looks like we have more than enough space. I'm not going to worry too much about that. So our tribe is now massive. We have 46 people already. Amazing. This is starting to slowly become a big, big town. Not a village anymore. It's slowly becoming a town. And we have three pregnant ladies. Yeah, they are nice. That was amazing. I'm very happy with this uh, migration group. Very, very happy. There's this is a lot of people running around our village. I love it. But we will see how much I love it when most of them are old people and we are struggling to get food to everybody. <laughs> That's going to be interesting to see how much I love it, all these people then. Is it done? Our temple is done, guys. Finally, we have... Our temple, it's finished, it's done. It took us a while, but we have one now. Very happy about this. Excellent. The first time in a very long time that we have a temple. So now let's start using all that stone that we were telling our building guys to gather. Let's start using that. Where is it? Where is it? Here you go. So how are we going to do this? Let's build it maybe from this side, that side, down here. I don't know. It's not going to... Let's use the, the stuff that's been given to us. Ah. Let's try that again. Let's 
start from year, go to year, go to there. Go, maybe we keep the tree in there, go here, go something like this, and then go straight, or let's not make it straight, let's go all the way like this, let's see how that will look. I'm not going to give it high priority, let's, let's just do it and see how it looks. But we finally have a temple. Finally, finally, finally. Unfortunately, they won't use it, but uh, at least we have one. What? Another group of migra migra migrants. A second one. I didn't know that was possible. Let's check them out. So yes, okay, charisma, okay, fitness, excellent skill. Does he bring his family with him? He's bringing his two daughters. So that's his daughters, but it doesn't look like it's his wife. Let's check her out. Okay, let's first check the daughters. Okay, unfortunately, it doesn't seem to be that great. Clumsy and indecisive. How is there other stuff? We will have to see that. Okay, let's just let's just slow it down a bit. Let's check this one out. Clumsy. Our other stuff looks okay so far. Let's check the last one. Wow, this is a surprise. I didn't Okay, so unfortunately this girl's intelligence is bad, but all our other stuff is good. So how old are they? 14, 14, 43, 23. So this guy brought himself a nice family with him, even though they are not. We are going to accept him because this lady is excellent as well, except for her intelligence, but her other stats are looking very good. So let's accept him. Wow, this, this is really a surprise. I didn't know we we're going to get two migration groups in a, in one episode that that's something i didn't know so that's amazing we have now a few people that can help as well so let's let's see they are not too weak so we have four new people that we can put somewhere So let's add that four people for now to to the raw guys for now. Wow. Okay, this this game is really keep keep on surprising me. We are now sitting at 51 people. And we have two more pregnancies and two babies coming. This, this is something I didn't, I didn't think we're going to be this big in this episode. We might even ask our raw guys to, to help with food. So let's see how that works out. We might uh, change that, but let's let, let's let them gather the other food. Let's leave the raw zip to the, to the one group and we just see how it looks. Because our raw materials is kind of looking good, but now, now we might have to start slowly considering another hut. This is amazing. What I have to do is my crafting guys are going to start getting busy again. Let's uh, tell them, okay, I did put this on 20, the the buy faces. 
but we will seriously let's pick it up to 30 at least and our let's pick this up to 20 the other stuff is still fine but wow I did not expect the second migrant group to come in So we have these two pregnant ladies. We keep on growing. I really love this. I really, really love this. Wow, this, this tribe is really getting big now. I think after the, this walls is done, I'm going to put a few benches here as well. I almost, I almost thought that was another, another migrant group. Luckily, it was only a birth. Let's start doing it. Where's our builders? Building guys, where are you? Where's that chair? Let's see how that will look. Let's see, maybe put the long ones here. Short, okay, we can put the long one maybe Maybe there, like that, yes. Put one there. Maybe put one here somewhere over there. Put one here. Put one here. Maybe put one here in the middle. And maybe one over there. Let's see how it looks. I'm not going to push it. Okay, I'm not happy with this one. Let's cancel that one. And we see if we put another one, maybe a little bit like now. Maybe like that. Let's see. Let's see how it looks. I can always take it away later uh, still not happy with that one let's see if i use a small one
Okay, small one might be better, yes. Yes, let's use a small one. The food are doing okay. Guys are not really getting other stuff. Rosy, rosy, rosy. Let's change that to rosy. Change it to rosy. Stone wall completed. Change it to rosy. And so let's tell the the raw guys. To just get a uh, rosy as well. So summer has been kind to us at least again. So this is becoming very interesting. Two migration groups, our temple is done. We have a lot of pregnancies. I'm really happy about that. very soon going to be autumn but I'll push a little bit harder before I change to fishing and hunting maybe go a few days into autumn we'll see how long the rosy blasts But so far so good. I see we need more stone. Maybe I should give the guys a break. Some of them are unhappy. Let's give them a break quickly. I'm going to give them a small break. Just before winter. Ah, before uh, autumn. And let's tell our building guys to again get us some stone as well. The food is a lot so let's give them a chance to, to try and take two days at least. Just so they are ready for the coming autumn and winter. I might put a fire over here, it might look cool. 
and it might bring more people to the temple area. I think we'll we'll do a test and see. Let's just give them another day. Oh no. Okay, I'm not gonna give them another day. But this village is taking a nice shape currently. I'm, I'm enjoying it. I'm really enjoying it. We have more pregnancies, two more pregnancies that I can see. I am really, really, really enjoying this, I must say. Another birth, excellent people. How's the food looking? We're already two days in. I'll just check if this keeps falling, we're gonna definitely do fishing and hunting soon okay definitely the next day we're gonna start fishing and hunting I might destroy this benches after the, the walls are done and put them closer to the walls so that the people sit and sit only one way. And I think I'm going to put a fire right here. There's enough space to put a fire there that will bring a few people at least to the temple area. But let's give them an oak. Okay, our first person is going to pass away as well. Will be our first death in uh, the stripe. Let's quickly see how many days she has left. Between 10 and 11 days left. So I'm going to let them remove this, this one, remove this one. These ones I'm happy with. We'll see, but these two I will replace with other ones as soon as the walls are complete. Okay, Rosie is still coming in, so I'm still going to let the fish uh, come in a little bit more. Okay, let's maybe push them to rest for two days. Let's let's bite the, that bullet and do it. Let's bite that bullet. If some people have to sleep outside, it's fine. And when they start, let's do the changes. So I have 14 people. Let's put four hunters. And the other guys will put on and just take them off. And we'll put the other 10 on fishing.
Okay, I don't have a choice. They will have to start working, unfortunately. The food is too little. How many idle people do we currently have? Eleven. Let's quickly check the children. Too weak. Too weak. Too weak. Too weak. We have one that can work. Let's add that one to the building, guys. Okay, so the fishing did come in nicely at least so let's do a different okay there another child was born so let's go to our raw guys we can take rosie off now let's add let's see what they they can get of this other other fruits and stuff Okay, so they completed one of the benches. I might also see what I'm gonna do with this bench. Maybe move it against the wall as well. So let's let's take that one off as well. How big are we now? 54 people. One pregnancy currently, few babies. How long do we have left, ma'am? Six days. So we're almost in year five. A lot is happening in, uh, you can say, year five. And they are bringing in a lot of, uh, let's quickly do a change here. This row zip, they can change to that. Me, they can keep this row zip, we can change to this. To what did I change that other one? Oh, okay, that, let's change it to this. Let's change that one to, are they getting any, yes, some of this. And do we have one for mushrooms at least? Yes, we do. So things are looking really good currently.
We really have a little bit of a stone sword shortage, but uh, we should get enough. This area is full of stone. The food situation is looking better, a lot better than it did. Let's see, 161, 43, let's, let's give them that two dice that I wanted to give them. Hopefully we can, oh wait, let's cover a little bit more. Just, just when winter starts, we'll give them two dice. So let's uh, just push through and get a little bit more. The tribe is really getting weaker. As you can see, our leader is getting weaker. So our stuff are changing over here at policies. How old is she now? 66. This lady has about three days left, maybe a little bit more. We are also running very low on sticks currently. Okay, so let's give them two days. Let's push for two days. And just when I say that there's a breakdown. Let's see how many people sleeps outside. It's just before winter. So let's see, moment of truth. How many people won't have a place to sleep? Not 
Nobody. Great. That's great news. Hold up, hold up, hold up. So we have our first death, the poor lady that passed away. Where is she? Did she pass away in the heart? Looks like it. I don't see her body anywhere. So we did lose our our first person, unfortunately. She had a very long life, very good life. She was part of a big tribe that's taking humanity forward rest in peace thank you for oh there she is thank you for your contribution to the tribe thanks a lot matia hopefully your son can carry on your legacy and if you look at it he is doing not too badly okay so we had our first death in the tribe due to old age at least so the tribe is doing well. I'm I'm very happy. First death. And there we are at five years now. Not bad for a tribe to only have their first death in five five in-game years okay so they're going to sleep we can now change the policy back we did manage to to at least get uh, two days for everybody to rest including the lady that passed away So I am gonna we are in winter. I'm gonna stop our our raw guys are messing around. So I am gonna stop them from collecting food now. Let them concentrate on their jobs. Also mushrooms take it away. Concentrate on the stuff that we need, please. Hunting and fishing is doing well. All of them had a lack of big break. So now it's time to push again, people. It's time to push again. We are slowly but surely losing workforce you can see here so let's take these two out and they can fill in all the other positions now we have a lot of uh, logs Let's see, our population is slowly get, growing older, El, um, 10 elderly, idle 14, so it, let's see who's not uh, pulling their weight currently. Too weak, too weak, so a lot of the children. And we have, 
our old population are getting to a point where they are not cannot do their part anymore but uh, we have a lot of young people and they should uh, carry us very soon so i'm not worried at all things are currently still good we'll see how long it stays that way Let's see how our hunters are doing. Hunting some pigs. Let's see where they are. A lot of pigs. A lot of pigs. Okay, great. There you go. So year 5 has been a very busy year for our tribe so far. With a lot of things happening. This tribe so far has definitely been our best tribe. And I'm really enjoying the game at this moment. Fifty-four people, one pregnancy. Who's the pregnant lady? Here you go. It's Matia. They Matia has given birth. Guys, you must fix that, please, as soon as possible. Very nice having this big of a workforce. Food is at least not doing bad. The guys are slowly getting their raw materials back. And we're getting a lot of stuff done, which I really like.
And this is really starting to feel like a nice, decent village and tribe. And I really like to see all the people running around. And you currently cannot see any frame drops or lagging or anything. So this, the, the engine of this game is really good. So well done developers. We have a pregnancy again. Who's that that's pregnant over there? Let's check. Wow, you have a massive family. And uh, let's quickly check your stuff out. The only negative trait you have is your charisma, your unfriendly. You don't, don't like people. A lot of people can relate to you that don't like people. You're pregnant. You're very big. You're very smart. You're very able. And you're resolved. So, but wow, don't you have a massive family. A lot of brothers and sisters. And then one child currently with another one on the way. Oh, it's already born. No, it's still on the way. So I think we have a good mix in our tribe of uh, people that's able to do stuff and so forth. We got uh, very good migrating groups. The guys did bring our uh, raw materials nice and back, so let's ask them to help us again with uh, some food. I don't think we'll find any rosy, but let's uh, just put it on and see what I can bring in before the, the season is over, winter is over. But year 5 has been an amazing year for our tribe. I must say I'm very very happy with this year. And we got so much done. Look at our temple is done, our complex around the temple is almost done. And we'll make it nice. We'll we'll maybe take away the chairs and add new ones, add a fire there. So I have a lot of plans for that. Food situation is looking way better. They are at least finding some uh, fruits and veggies. Some clams as well. A few mushrooms, honeycombs. So we have a good mix of food for our people.
and spring is fast approaching. Wow, this episode has gone really fast for me. I, I, I really enjoyed it and that must be why it felt so fast. The tribe is really at this stage running as a well-oiled machine. Okay, so there we go. We finished year five. The tribe did exceptionally well. Our temple is done. We started construction on a temple complex. We have currently 55 people, two pregnancies. We unfortunately had our first day. All our stuff, food and everything is looking great at this stage. Uh, Thank you guys for watching. Hit the like if you liked the video. Subscribe if you haven't. And share the video. Let's uh, get the game out there a little bit more. And uh, help the developers. And they might bring us more and more stuff that we want for the game. So thank you guys for watching. And see you guys in the next one.